Meerkat Mail by Emily Gravitz. Sunny lives in the Kalahari Desert. It is very dry and very hot. Sometimes Sunny thinks it is too hot. Sunny comes from a large family. They work together, play together, eat together, learn together and sleep together. Remember, a meerkat alone is on its own. Stay safe, stay together and stay away from jackals. In fact, they do everything together. They are very close. Sometimes Sunny thinks they are too close. Sometimes Sunny wishes that he could live somewhere else. So he packs his suitcase and writes his family a note. Dear everyone, I'm off to find somewhere perfect to live. Don't worry, Mum, I'll be staying with our mongoose relatives, so we'll be quite safe. Love from Sunny. P.S. I promise to write. On Monday, Sunny visits his Uncle Bob. To Mum and Dad, it's a lot like being at home here, except that I'm the biggest. The weather is sunny and the food is fantastic. Lots of scorpions. Yum. Best thing is, no one has to keep lookout because... There's this bird which goes squawk when there is a danger. I told Uncle Bob our family motto is stay safe, stay together. He told me theirs is run and hide. From Sonny. Uncle Bob's family make him very welcome. But Sonny doesn't quite fit in. So on Tuesday, Sonny goes to stay with his cousins Scratch and Mitch and the rest of their family. Dear Mum and Dad, we have been living in an old termite mound, but we are moving. There is plenty to eat. Yours, ticklishly, Sunny. Sunny is getting itchy feet. He decides it's time to move on. On Wednesday, he arrives at his cousin Edward's. Dear Mum, Dad, Grandad and Grandma, I'm staying on a farm. Ed's favourite food is chicken. I haven't tried it yet but I've had plenty of eggs. Tell Mickey they're not as good as scorpions. Love from Sunny. Sunny is not at all sure that eggs totally agree with him. On Thursday, he heads off to stay with his cousins Mildred and Frank. Dear Mum, Dad and everyone, it is raining quite hard. Hope the weather is better at home. Loads of love from Rainy. P.S. Great Aunt Maureen was right. I should have packed an umbrella. Sonny hates getting wet, so he decides to leave. By Friday evening, Sonny has reached Madagascar. Dear all, arrived at Auntie B's and Uncle Rob's. It is very late and very dark. I think it may be past my bedtime. Aunt B and Uncle Rob don't seem to have noticed. I am leaving as soon as it gets light. Yawns faithfully. Wish you were here, Sonny. Sonny is afraid of the dark. He can't think of anything worse. Until on Saturday, he arrives at Great Aunt Flo's. Dearest family, Great Aunt Flo lives on her own in a marsh. It is dark and wet. The food is disgusting and I am lonely, cold and tired. I really, really, really wish you were here, or that I was not. All my love, kisses and snuggles, soggy Sunny. Sunny is beginning to worry that nowhere is right for him. But then, on Sunday, Sunny arrives somewhere very dry and very hot, where everyone is very close. I'm home. And it is perfect.